IPA takes the pain out of packet analysis. It does all of the heavy lifting for you by parsing Wi-Fi captures three times to organize it into conversations and calculate the true airtime utilized by each transmission. As a result, filtering wireless traffic is very snappy. This tool is critical to engineers because it gives them X-ray vision into the invisible world of wireless networking. IPA cleverly displays congestion caused by neighboring networks and Wi-Fi overhead in a multi-layered pie chart called the TreePie. For example, this chart represents Wi-Fi traffic from a single access point before it makes it onto the wired network. This tree pie breaks out from access points in the center to clients, then frame type, and subframe type. IPA uses colors to display the three types of frames in Wi-Fi. For example, these blue slices are the data frames that get passed onto the wired network. As you can see, there are 52 clients within a wireless network, and they were transmitting their data frames at an average rate of 9.3 megabits per second. The green colors in the center represent the data rates. Dark green represents fast speeds, while light green represents slow speeds. The table on the right is where you can track retransmission rates of every single client on the channel. You can see who is talking slow and who is talking fast. Let's take a look at all of the overhead within the BSSID by removing the filters I have applied. Here we see some orange and purple slices. These represent management and control frames which help deliver the data frames to their destinations. Quite often, management and control frames are sent at very slow speeds, taking up a significant amount of airtime. When access points occupy the same channel, they share the available airtime. When a lot of networks occupy the same channel, their transmit opportunities get smaller and smaller. Your access points traffic may only account for a small slice of time in a heavily congested environment, as we see here. In the Analysis tab, you will find expert tips for optimizing your wireless. First, select one or more BSSIDs you are interested in. IPA will then display suggestions on how to improve the channel selection, increase the security, disable protection mechanisms, identify legacy devices in the network, and discover users with high retransmissions. This is where you will find the most critical issues in the wireless network and how to resolve them. Let's say a particular iPad is having issues on the wireless network. Because IPA crunched through the data in the beginning, filtering is quick and efficient. Simply enter in the MAC address of the Apple iPad to see its activity across the channel. By referencing the active selection window, you can see that this device has an 83% retransmission rate. That means 83% of all of the frames that it transmitted were duplicates. Let's look at the individual packets to see if there is anything that indicates a problem here. Here you notice the access point was sending streams of data packets and they are acknowledged by the iPad with a block acknowledgement. However, the block acknowledgement is not being heard by the access point. This causes the AP to send all of the frames again and again. IPA allows you to highlight specific events like roaming quickly. Use the subframe filter to remove all of the beacons, action, and probe response management subframes. We will then remove the data and control frames to reveal all roaming events to see how long it took for a device to reassociate to a new BSSID. Packet analysis can be like searching for a needle in a haystack. Fortunately, with IPA's filter you can find exactly what you're looking for very quickly. At any point in time, you can copy the data to the clipboard and paste it into a report. Whether it is an image from a tree pie or text information from the data tables, this information gives you something to provide to your customers that shows that the Wi-Fi was implemented correctly. As you've seen, IPA will help you visualize Wi-Fi channel congestion. It will tell you what optimizations can be made to your wireless network and provides you with deliverables for your customers. Download a free trial at metageek.net.